Okay, on to our guest tonight, and she's probably one of the youngest CEOs in the country. Aged just 11, Shakira Rahman has been made the kid boss of the international humanitarian charity Penny Appeal. It's hoping she'll bring a child's voice to what are often seen as adult problems. And joining her is the founder, Adim Yunis. Thank you both so much for for talking to us this evening. I'm going to start with you, Shakira, obviously. Um, So how does one become a young CEO? Well... I think I went to an event um, that Penny and Pill were hosting and I met the founder of Penny and Pill, Adeem, and I was talking to him and we just had a little conversation and I think he just really liked me and he interviewed me and that's just really how I got the job, really. And how have your friends reacted to this new role? I think my friends are extremely supportive. They're so excited to see what's coming next this year. It's just amazing. Oh, I, can, I can see the attraction with making you a, a kid boss, actually, because you're incredibly confident, amazingly uh, uh, eloquent and clearly very passionate uh, about being a part of, of the charity. And you recently travelled to the Gambia, didn't you? Yes. Um, so, yeah, I did go to the Gambia and I wanted to like see how life... Um, in different countries, uh, like with children, um, it was a real eye opener for me because I've ne- I learn about poverty, but until you see it, you really see what really happens. It was amazing. I spoke to some of the children my age, and what I learned is that it doesn't matter how much you have; they're exactly the same as me. They're happy. They're always smiling, even though they don't have as much. It was amazing oh my goodness you're such an inspiring child <laughs> Adeem I can I can <laughs> see why you have uh, cho- chosen to do this role I mean she's incredible she's absolutely amazing and you know Penny Peel is all about the, the, the young people's agenda and how we can keep the youth and the energy within the charity uh, and meeting Shakira I thought to myself you know there's there's nobody like it and when I when I initially met her she kind of schooled me on on young people's issues she said this is what's happening at the moment this is what's kind of the the, the, the issues and the challenges yeah. And she's also kind of like wanted to change the world. She had this real kind of passion uh, and this real empathy, but also this, uh, I guess, this kind of energy uh, and, and eternal kind of yeah. optimism that you, that you, that as grown-ups, I yeah. guess, we lose along the way some, some, yeah, somewhere. Yeah, I'm sure. Yeah, and, and I was just thinking that if you were a few years older, you could have gone for, for <laughs> Prime Minister of the country. I'm sure you do <laughs> phenomenally well at the moment. Um, but what sort of work then, in all seriousness, and what sort of impact are you hoping that Shakira will have when the charity is concerned? Huge impact. Uh, I mean, you know, we are paired up with projects right here at home. Uh, so where we do uh, sponsoring orphans mm-hmm. uh, uh, internationally, we have adoption and fostering services right yeah. here at home in the UK where we uh, do uh, food distribution internationally in 30 crisis hit countries yeah. around the world. Uh, we do food banks here within community centre, churches and mosques. So and yeah. the work that, the, yeah. that Shakira will be doing in particular will be around youth and, and young people's issues. Uh, you know, and, and yeah. a lot of that is... And, and giving it a voice, really, where, where the a, charities... A voice for, so, for, for young sorry, people Sorry, well. I don't really have that much time, but I wanted one more question with you, Shakira. What is it that you want to do later on in life? Really, I just want to give advice to people. I really want to help with things that um, are affecting people yeah. in the world. I just want to give advice how to help those people. So. Yeah. And do you know what, Shakira? I think you will definitely achieve that and even more because I think you're absolutely fantastic. Well, Shakira and Adine, thank you both so much for coming in.